Second one is spinocerebellar. So this has only a first and a second order neuron, and it's not gonna go past the cerebellum. What does this mean about this pathway? Well, it's not gonna be conscious per perception. Your cere cerebellum is related to equilibrium and balance and motor coordination. So this is going to be primarily um, proprioceptive information from the muscles and tendons that then allow your body to coordinate movements. So this is the detailed picture of this one. Um, you've got proprioceptive information from the muscle spindles, tendons, joint capsules that is gonna come in from both sides of the brain, both sides of the body, I'm sorry, and then travel up to tell the cerebellum where your body's position is and adjust what you're doing to be able to better have motor, better motor output. The cerebellum, of course, is going to provide output to the primary motor cortex to adjust that. But this pathway itself terminates in the cerebellum and therefore is unconscious. So you're not aware of how you're adjusting your body due to this input, the sensory input. So this would be information from some from um, lamellar corpuscles, muscle spindles, and tendon organs.